Welcome to another video of this pattern play python tutorials. In this video we're going to talk about user defined functions. So let's create a new file, new file user defined functions. So let's define a function. The keyword is def define my square is a function which is going to do a square for a number which is passed is i and then it's going to do a square value i double asterisk 2 that means it's going to square and then return square value now if i run this it's not going to do anything because obviously i have not call this function now let's call this function I'm gonna say print square of 4 my square 4 and you can see it says square of 4 is 16 let's do the same for 5 so you can see that whatever the value I have pa passed here it goes in it square roots and return the value back now let's define a variable a equal to 6 and then instead of passing the value 6 I'm going to use the variable a and I'm going to say run you can see square of 6 is 36 so this is how you would call a function in Python now let's use a function which takes in multiple parameters not just one and having some default values too so let's see that so <clears throat> I created another function here which is my default value a equals 1 and b equals 10 all I'm doing is just summing up a and b if there are no values for a and b it's gonna sum up the default value 1 for a and 10 for b so just passing 100 for both a and b it's going to sum up 100 and the value would be 200 so function call 200 now let's just pass the value of please note that when i'm passing both a and b in the order how i have defined in the function i don't have to mention a equals but in here i have to mention a equals 5 because i'm not going to pass the value of b so in this case b is going to be 10, a is going to be 5 and the return value would be 15. So function call 15. Now let's do just value b equals 5 rather than a equals 5 the output would be 6. Now let's do a list let's pass the values from a list and call this function so I have a list with 15 and 20 as two values and I'm gonna call this function I'm gonna say a equals list 1 0 and b equals list 1 index 1 so 0 is 15 1 is 20 let's do that so 15 plus 20 it's gonna be 35 a again index 0 b index 1 of the list values 15 and 20 thank you for watching